Hey there, this is Anthony Gordon with Avid Artist Relations coming at you from South by Southwest 2012. We're here at the uh, Tape Op party with uh, Laura Thurman and Larry Crane from Tape Op Magazine. Uh, if you're an audio guy, you definitely know Larry, uh, the venerable Larry Crane. Thank you so much for having us out here. Uh, how long have you been doing South by Southwest? This is the fourth year, um, and uh, it gets bigger every time. Yeah. It sure does. What, what brings you out here? What's the, the motivation for coming out here and, and being a part of this whole crazy? Um, you know, to do the party was kind of just like a thank you to our readers, you know. I think that was the initial idea that, that Laura had, and, and um, it's been great because we meet a lot of folks. We meet a lot of studio people and they live in the area, too, and we get some bands to come down and play, and it's fun. <laughs> yeah, you know, people talk about the changing landscape of the recording community, the music industry. But you come down here, it looks alive and well to me. I mean, what's your take on it? Um, you know, my, I've always lived on the margins of the music business myself. So, you know, when people talk about things like dwindling budgets and labels not signing bands or whatever, I, that was always the case for the world I work in most of the time. So, yeah, I, I always there's always clubs, there's always bands playing, there's always records being made. Music isn't going anywhere. I think music is great. Music's healthy. Music business to me has always been a bit of an ugly thing. <laughs> so I think, I think it's, you know, I think it's great. You see like thousands and thousands of people down here just because of music. Yeah. That's pretty awesome. Yeah, it's reinvigorating. I think it always kind of refills my gas tank for, for my love of music. So you had a lot of, uh, you have a lot of partners coming down here working with you. What's the reaction been from the uh, audio community who are your advertisers who've been coming out to support your party and support the magazine? Oh gosh, we've had, well, um, this year, Isotope and Sound Toys, and of course, Avid, and um, I mean, we have eight other sponsors this year. Um, we've been really well supported. It's been great. Um, every year, it seems to get better. This is our fourth year doing the party, and uh, it's been a lot of fun. It's a great way for people in the recording industry just to get together and hang out and talk, and, and also to listen to bands, you know, so... It's wonderful. It's the perfect place during South by Southwest for tape op to have something like this, you know. And I moved to Austin about five years ago, so when I came down from Seattle, I thought, wow, you know, that's very synergistic. So it made sense. So we thought, okay, let's give it a try. And it's been going on. We've, we've really enjoyed it. Yeah, it's been fun. You know, I've been here seven times, but only during South by Southwest. So I have no idea what Austin is really. I'm assuming it's like this every weekend. I'm hoping. It's going to be amazing. <laughs> on six. On six? Yeah, it's pretty crazy. Yeah. Well, it does. I've seen some happy uh, contest winners. Some people have been winning Pro Tools here, other audio stuff. It's it's cool that, you know, we're, we're able to work with you guys to give a little something back to folks out here. There's a lot of happy people. This is the only time you're going to see a crowd yell enthusiastically when I said Pro Tools 10. And a crowd is all, yeah! Like, and I'm like... That's the funniest thing. Like, you know, where else would you see that happen? <laughs> I know, only in South by Southwest. So if you folks don't know, you must know. For you young up-and-coming recording types, if you want to learn about recording, you must, must subscribe to Tape Op. It is the Bible. Uh, and it's, it's been in business. How long have you guys been in business now? Um, 16 years. 16 years. That's a venerable institution of audio. If you want to learn, I, I've, yeah, I'm such an enormous fan, I can't even tell you. In fact, your cover story here, the bunny cover, and your cover story here with Jakir King, Jakir is actually the first guy to use our new HDX platform on an album. He worked on the Punch Brothers record with it. Yeah. Cool. Well, thank you so much for having us here. We're going to uh, drink some cold beers on your dime, so thank you for that. And. Uh, We'll see you next time. Keep following us on Twitter, at Avid and at Pro Tools AR Man. And uh, we'll got more for you coming at you from South by Southwest 2012.